Frigidaire. We introduce the first home freezer. The first pulsator agitator washer. And now we introduce the Frigidaire Orbit Clean Dishwasher, designed with a unique wash arm that gives you four times more water coverage for a consistently better clean. Frigidaire, over 90 years of legendary innovation. See the full line of Frigidaire appliances at Ventura TV Electronics and Appliances. Hi, I'm John Malos. Welcome to this live edition of Connect With Me on the showroom floor at Ventura TV. Today it's on the air, off the presses. We're flying home today with Ronnie Paul. You can call in at 436-MeTV, option 11. Do call in, do turn down the sound. This is the live edition of Connect With Me. We're back in a moment. And welcome back to the program here on Connect With Me on Comcast Channel 187 and 43.6. Hope you had a great Father's Day uh, weekend. Happy belated Father's Day to all you people out there. Hey, uh, today we're going to talk about a man who's been around this market on television for nearly 10 years. He is a staple. You have been watching him for nine and a half years on 33.2 and Comcast Channel 200. Flying Home with Ronnie Paul has de uh, developed quite a following here in the Central Valley. He's on every Saturday night from 7 p.m. to 1 a.m. If you tune in, here's what you might see. You know, Mark, I went to come visit you. Gee, you really fixed up that place. Uh, nice up there, the studio. Oh, thank you. And I have a surprise that I want to show you because I notice before you go. I noticed you got those old, old Frigidaires up there. Yeah, there. yeah, those are antiques. I have Antique the I refrigerators. Have, I have the commercials for those No guys. kidding. Well, yeah, I'd love to see them. Yeah, I watch before you go. Love to see them. Yeah. Hello? Hello? Yes, how are you? Hey, Ronnie, uh, John from Hanford. Oh, how are you? Good, good, good. <laughs> Just wanted to give you a call and say hi. All right. What's yeah, I appreciate you guys and... Uh, your programming, you know, I just I can't tell you enough how much uh, my wife Eileen and I uh, appreciate your show there and uh, all the great clips, cartoons, shows from the past, movies from the past. I mean, you guys have the best thing going on. Oh, yeah, now we got something good. Uh, oh. that, that, uh, Mark is going to explain. Don't go away. Okay, yeah, okay. I brought your thing. or well, uh, you explain I'll go ahead that? and listen up then. Okay. And, uh, you have a good evening. All right, thanks for calling. Okay, okay, bye-bye. Right. Bye-bye. Getting back to your... Boy, I didn't realize how nice it's set up and everything, you know, that, that little studio... In case I want to simulcast or I want to do something, you've got something we'll ready be, for me, we'll too? We'll be ready to, ready to yeah. handle all your broadcast needs. Yeah, everything, too. And it's Wow. Ronnie Paul and Mark Sheeran on the Flying Home with Ronnie Paul show here recently. Live in our studio now is Ronnie Paul wearing the dreaded Los Angeles <laughs> Dodgers cap, ready to take your phone calls. Can't figure out if he's a Dodger fan wearing that half Dodger blue shirt and Arizona Diamondbacks on the other side of the uh, shirt. Anyway, you are here. I mean, you are there. We are here. 436 Me TV Option 11. Do call in and talk to our friend, our dear friend, Ronnie Paul. Flying home with Ronnie Paul every Saturday night. You can watch us here every day, Monday through Friday, live at 1030 to 11. We're back with our guest. Remember, turn down the sound if you call in. When you like Ventura TV Appliance on Facebook, it's nice. But when you love the Samsung big screen we deliver, it's even better. Our website is cool, and it's a good place to start. But you really should touch the merchandise before you buy. Time for that upgrade to an HD 3D web-enabled Samsung TV. Get the best selection, price, and service in town without waiting. Come in to Ventura TV Appliance and touch the merchandise today. 
We know it's on the air, off the presses on this day. It is uh, most every Monday. However, today is potpourri, is it not, Ronnie? Exactly. We can talk about just about anything today. Oh, yeah, and everything, too. And a happy Father's Day to you. Belated. 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 Uh, thank you. I had a great father's no, Day No, your weekend. son that came to the studio, very nice. Very yeah. nice. And your daughter came, too. Yeah, he yeah. likes being on the air. Well, bring My him daughter's again. a little bit shy. But, no, 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 no. But bring him again. Yeah, well, one no, Saturday, well, like one Saturday where you're not going to ball games. <laughs> Come on down. <laughs> so, so your show, I, let me ask you something about your show. Um, you do have a following, as I said, in the monologue. Uh, you're kind of a staple in this market now. Nine and a half years, I mean, there's something to be said for that. So who follows you and why are you so successful? Who are these people that call in and watch you every Saturday? Well, night? some of them have been on radio. When I was on radio, you know, it stuck. they stuck with me. But a lot of these are new, you know. You have to do like you do, you know, the simple, you know, down-to-earth type like you do. Make uh, adjustments? Yeah, make it, no, just be, you make just be yourself. You make adjustments along the way? Yeah, I learned. You learn yeah. from your, like, you know, your past mistakes, you know, when you're on the air, because, you know, you watch how you talk or you move, your eye contact and everything, too. So that's how, you know, and you're, and nobody gives requests uh, for TV shows, like on radio, they ask yeah. for a request. Now they do for TV. They, they, they request, but they want this certain episode, yeah. like Mr. Ed or like that. And luckily, it may take me a couple I want to weeks. see how many calls you generate today. Jerry Dyer was here just the other day. He generated 19 calls. That's pretty good. Well, I, Of course, we were on for an hour, but yeah, this is only half an hour. I, know where, I see him Sunday morning. I know where he has his coffee after church. Is that right? Yeah, he's yeah. a nice guy. Did you talk to him? I talked to him. I gave him a couple copies of the show so he can watch and everything. Is too. that right? Yeah, he, even he watches well, too. Gotta, you've yeah. got to get him on. For as a guest, I try, I'm trying. He's busy. He's a bit, as you know, he's a busy man. Every time you watch the news, well, he wasn't you too know, busy to come on this program. Well, that's I'm good. Sure, yeah. you know, I got his number. Do you I'll, know his number? Huh? All right, give him after the air. <laughs> <laughs> No, I know where to find them. You know, know, know where to get. Yeah, to get you know where to get them on Sunday morning, right? After. So right where is that, by the way? Where is that? No, you know, I, you don't don't want, I don't want to say that you don't everybody want to say. will go, but okay. he's well known right. at this place. Yeah, okay. I want to see how many phone calls this guy can generate today. 436 Me TV, option 11. Do call in, ask some questions to Ronnie Paul. You can watch his show, of course, every Saturday night, 7 p.m. to 1 a.m. What is that? 33.2. That's the Gary Cocola station, right? Yeah, we've had some technical get, uh, difficulties with the transmitter. Oh, uh, Rick okay. Bentley wrote a column Thursday that we're having trouble, so yeah. thanks to Rick. Everything we still were having trouble, and then what about uh, Comcast? Get you on Comcast? No, we're on okay. Comcast. So 200. 200. We're all yeah. right on that. But there. you've expanded your show. Um, two more you, hours. So, yeah, two more hours. Why is that? Well, people requested wanted more, but that's still what I Did had. You get a done. raise? They they double your pay? Not too much raise. Okay. Though, all right. But uh, <laughs> but what I had planned for the night, I still can't I still can't finish it. Is like that right? I did Father's Day shows, everything. I wanted to do Leave it to Beaver, and I wanted to do Donna Reed. I didn't have time. See? So you need to start at noon. <laughs> no, I really, I can go on all night. We're, 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 gonna, we're planning to do a uh, holiday marathon, you know, after Christmas. <laughs> holiday or Christmas marathon. <laughs> Is that right? Why don't you do it like a July 4th marathon? Well, we could do that, too, but we never know. Well, so, I'll, I'll so have you as guest. The, what is the main theme, the focus of your show? What do you try to accomplish? What do you do? Well, what I do is what I did on radio. What you do is when they watch me, you don't know what I'm going to do. See, like an eye. Kind of like here. Yeah, you, yeah. Don't, yeah. <laughs> you don't know what I'm going to do. Like each week, like on Facebook, I follow Facebook whose birthday it is. I have friends that post. It's so a is birthday. it like this program, a little bit of cheap entertainment? Yeah, that's what yeah. it is. <laughs> just like, but, but just I like tie in the me, show. Right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> but I tie in with the events, like Father's Day, where yeah. I put my mind goes to uh, what shows make Father's Day show. Yeah, well, I remember that show. What is that? Father knows Father best. Father knows best. Yeah, I remember that. that. <laughs> yeah, and I watched it, and they reran it on uh, on the uh, Antenna TV. The same yeah. episode I did. So that's how I do uh, work. So I just get an idea whose so birthday how's your, it is. Uh, how's your How's your working relationship with Gary Cocola? Oh, by the way, oh, very good. He loves it. He yeah, he loves it. he loves the show. Doesn't he, he watches it from his house in yeah. Monterey. We We don't have a very good relationship here with Gary, but that's a different story. No, no I'm no, kidding. No, no, no. If kidding. it wasn't for him, we wouldn't have this today. <laughs> no, you know I'm joking, <laughs> yeah, right? Absolutely. We love Gary Cocola. He's been on this program. Oh yeah, he was the first one. He was the first one. Yeah. Hey, we have a call. Let's call okay. one. All right. Good morning, you're on with Ronnie Paul, your first caller. What's your question? 
Hey, a couple of great TV personalities uh, bunched <laughs> together this morning. I watched your interview with Jerry Dyer last week on Thursday. That was great, terrific. It's great to get to know the man that's so uh, uh, instrumental in um, uh, creating the lifestyle that we're used to here in the Fresno area. That's great. Hey, what's, uh, what's your question for Ronnie? Oh, oh, looking for a question? Okay. My question is, John's not able to do it, but maybe Ronnie, can you get the mayor on your show? You know, I've tried uh, uh, Mayor Autry. He's a busy man. I've tried him. Many he's things. elusive. He's yeah, very even easy. Gary's he's like Barry, tried He's up. like Barry Sanders. He, yeah. goes, he hits the hole and gets away from you. Yeah, even yeah. I tried him, and then uh, uh, Swergen, I can keep trying, but she's a busy lady, too. You know, she's running for state control. I heard they're a tough interview. They're, they're avoiding you. Huh? They're avoiding you. No, it's not the interview. <laughs> but, you know, I guess certain politicians, you know, you know the deal. If you do I one, know. you got to do the other yeah, one. But, but we'll try. Well, we'll try. Well, yeah, but you put in the request, though, right? Yeah. Yeah, they, she won't come on. No. Yeah. Uh, Mayor Autry, former Mayor Autry, he's busy. He said yes and every time. I even told him he I'll even do in the heat of the night. eight years, yeah. and he couldn't find the time no. to come on your show. Come I even, on. I even show, uh, told him I'll put a heat of the night episode for you if you come. He says you got a deal, but I'm still waiting. No, no, no. You're waiting. You're holding the bag. <laughs> he left you holding the bag. <laughs> Oh, my goodness. But he sees me. He says, how you been and everything. Too. You well, see well, him, well, too? Yeah. I know where he hangs out, too. You do? You can't tell us, no, can you? No, I don't. <laughs> is it on Sunday morning, or where is no, it? No, I see him every day. I know where he hangs out every day. Every day? Yeah, every day. Alan Autry? Uh-huh. Okay. You know what his real name is, don't you? Uh, no, what is it? I don't remember. Off well, I'll uh, better not tell say off the air. Him. Yeah, I better okay. not say it. <laughs> anyway, uh, right, but Ronnie Paul is here, uh, flying home with Ronnie Paul. We're going to take a commercial break here. 436, me, TV Option 11, trying to figure out how many calls that Ronnie Paul can generate here. Already got one in the bag, and we're back in just a moment. When you're looking for KitchenAid innovation and quality, who has the answers, the selection, the price? Ventura TV Appliance. With billions in nationwide appliance buying power, more than Home Depot and Best Buy combined, we'll help you save. Our low prices on Energy Star qualified KitchenAid appliances save you energy and money and pay no interest on select models when paid in full within 12 months. Ventura TV Appliance, serving you since 1951. Flying home with Ronnie Paul, 436 Me TV Option 11. If you want to call in, this is the live edition of Connect With Me on Comcast Channel 187 and 43.6. So, uh, Ronnie, uh, I, you're a big sports fan. Very big. Gigantic sport. In fact, your uncle played for the Rams. Actually, we did our uh, interview a year and a half ago on him. On I, the, on the I know. I know. And we're still trying. He's, you know. Where he, is he? How come he can't call in on the program? <laughs> what's what's going on? I'll, I'll, I am working on it, so don't don't think I have forgotten you. Though. You're working on it the way Autry, Autry's working the on way it. Autry's working on it to come on your program <laughs> and Swearingen. Uh -huh. <laughs> come on, Ronnie, you're killing me. No, but you, your uncle's a great guy. He's still alive. Played. Well. Uh, give he us sounds a little the history. same. Give a little history now. He well, played when? He played, well, he played with the Rams from uh, 1951, no, 1947 to 52, you know, 55. Way before I was born. <laughs> yeah, way over there. He was on that championship team in 51 with the clips we showed. Yeah. Remember we showed that? Yeah, yeah we showed that. And then yeah, after that, that, no, he played at UCLA with uh, Mike Connors. Mike Connors and him went to school together. Yeah. Mike Connors did basketball. Mannix. And, uh, yeah, and Don Mannix. did, Uncle Don did, uh, did football. Then yeah. after football, he was an uh, offensive uh, uh, lineman coach. He coached the fearsome foursome. Yep. You know, Deacon Jones and, uh, and Olson. Olson yeah. and Rosie Greer. And, Rosie and Greer. There too. Then after yeah. that, he, was, he had his own show like this yeah. on, on uh, Sunday morning's Don Paul show. Yeah. Good morning. You're on with Ronnie Paul. How are you? And what's your question? Hey, caller. I, well, okay. That here's the here's the office. That was Autry calling. <laughs> yeah. That was Alan Autry calling. Um, no, if you do call in, you got to turn down the sound on your TV set, or else you won't hear us. Anyway, Ronnie Paul is here. So, so he he coached the fearsome. He foursome. coached the fearsome foursome, and he had and he commentated for CBS with uh, Gil Stratton. You know, on on uh, that was his partner. But on he worked CBS, with, uh, CBS, and he worked with uh, Ray Scott, Lindsey Nelson, all the, hey, all the Tom, time uh, Tom Brookshire, Pat Summerall. So yeah. I. Upstairs at Coliseum, when to go visit him, I, I met all those guys. They were fun. 
Yeah, so he's a former player, broadcaster. He yeah. knows the routine. So why doesn't? Why can't you get him to call in well, here on the he, show? Well, he likes his retirement quiet. I see. But he sounds the same. You know, you think he he has his broadcasting voice the same. So yeah, we'll work on it. Why does your program work, Ronnie Paul? Flying home with Ronnie Paul. Why does it work? Well, it's it's what people want to see. They see. I've always been good at, at programming, whether radio or, or not. See, I know what the people want to see, and Gary, you know, uh, we know what the, we know how, how to handle it. How do you know? How do you know what they want to see? Well, I know because you haven't seen. When's the last time you saw Sunny and Cher TV show? Long time. When it was on. So, yeah. See, so we show what we do is besides few shows from me TV and Tenet TV. But how do you know that's what people want to see? It works. I haven't failed yet. I know because I'm that way. You know, when you go back, when you watch in time. Uh, John, that, that this, you know, I remember this. Yeah. People remember, yeah. they they yeah. like to see. Yeah. Uh, they like to go back. All right, caller, I hope you got your TV sound down. What's your question? Hey, uh, my question is to Ronnie. Ronnie, I'm negotiating on my uh, patent right now with uh, Brothers. So they're talking up into uh, quite a few million there. Now, what if I give you a few million right there and I don't pay taxes on it? How would you like that? Oh, that sounds good. You know who this is, John? No. This is my puppet uh, man. This oh, is your Jack, puppet guy? Jack Fassett. Remember him? Oh, yeah. 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 Hi, Jack. How you doing? <laughs> yeah, what I got, I got this going this morning and everything else, and I want to see about if you want to go ahead and uh, take some money there, and I won't have to pay taxes on it. No. <laughs> well, this is off the deal. We'll, we'll talk about it after. But, John, you know how yeah. I found uh, Jack? Uh, tell, uh, tell John how we met. Oh, I was on the Letterman show. When I came back from the Letterman show, Ronnie was the only one that asked me to come on his show. That's and amazing. so I did. Yeah, and what year yeah. was that? That was in 1926, uh, I think. When they Ronnie? 2006, yeah. 2006, 2006, he went back to New York. He, went, he was man. on Le Here's the story. I, I'm, I'm watching Letterman, and this guy comes on. He says, uh, David and Letterman says, where are you from? Fresno, California. So I'm looking. I, I want to follow the, this. Yeah. And so <laughs> he's showing how to do the sock puppets and everything, yeah. you know, the puppet deal like that. Yeah. So I was amazed at like that. So I says to myself, gee, he'd be a great guest to have. So I says, gee, my odds are going to be not too good. So I asked, I left a message the day after, because he's a Who'd figure. Who you call? Friend. I called his house. I found out that he was listed in the in the <laughs> book. In the book. He's listed in the book. So I called. I called. Left a message, and he called uh, a few hours later. So we made arrangements, and he came on. I figured he'd be on 30, 47, 24. So why can't you talk to this guy and get him on the program here? All right. Well, here. Jack, it's up to you. Uh, uh, I think I can get him. He's easy to get for you. Jack, are you still there? Hey, I dropped off a videotape down there one time for you, if you remember. <laughs> <laughs> you did? <laughs> yeah, right down to Ventura Appliance, because I go down there all the time and buy my stuff from Ventura. All right, well, bring your puppets on here one day. We'll, we'll put you on the air. No, we'll, uh, we'll get you connected. We'll make the arrangements. Uh, yeah. How's that? Connected. Connect yeah, with connected. me. Connected. Connected. Yeah, we'll get you, you connected here with Connect With Me. That's right. So okay. This guy's a very good man, I yeah. tell you. Yeah, you know, and uh, that clip, uh, Jack, bring the clip you see. You see, because yeah. we have permission to run it, no matter okay. what. you got a got lot it. to get. I'm saying, Ronnie, if you'd like to, you know, go in with me on that, I'll do it. All right, we'll call okay. you uh, We'll call you later on today. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Thank you very much. Hey, uh, we're talking with Ronnie Paul here, flying home with Ronnie Paul. Let's take another clip, a look at one more clip of the Ronnie Paul show on Saturday nights, 33.2 and Comcast 200, 7 p.m. to 1 a.m., flying home with Mr. Ronnie Paul. Paul. Yeah, well, guess who walked in the door? Come on, Mark. Come on there. The new uh, new executive here. The, you wanted to know about t the channels of the new TV? Come on. Come on, right here. Come on, Mark. <laughs> mm. Here. So, Irene, this is, uh, you know, Mark, uh, famous Mark Sharon from Ventura TV? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Hi. 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 <laughs> Very good. And Mark, if you read in the paper, it has a brand new uh, new channels coming on, too. We were talking. There's a new channel we're interested in called the De uh, Ronnie Paul's Desi Lu channel. We uh, need to work on. Okay. Uh, like that. We'll have to work Doesn't on that, that one. Sound good? Uh, yeah, <laughs> like that. But Irene, you want to ask him anything before he explains anything? Well, uh, where do you get the uh, the, uh, the listing of all the channels uh, that are going to be or that are out? Yeah, the, the the best way to get that is is uh, by going on the internet. If you uh, type in 
uh, freetvfresno.com, uh, you will be able to uh, see a tab which says uh, local listings, local TV listings. And if you click on that, it'll, it'll produce a list for you, a detailed list, not only on, about our channels, but all the channels that are available to anyone that has an antenna. When you like Ventura TV Appliance on Facebook, it's nice. But when you love the Whirlpool appliances we deliver, it's even better. Our website is cool, and it's a good place to start. But you really should touch the merchandise before you buy. Touch the new Whirlpool Ice Collection. It offers a modern style made to create an inspiring kitchen experience. Save big on this Whirlpool Black Ice or White Ice Kitchen. Come in to Ventura TV Appliance and touch the merchandise today. Hey, so you were on with Mark Sheeran there on your program, yeah. the owner of Ventura TV, and now Ventura Broadcasting. You go to VenturaBroadcasting.com, and there's a list of about 80 new channels there. What's your favorite there, Ron? My favorite is this peanut butter and jelly, because it's cartoons. <laughs> it's classic cartoons. It has You're the a cartoon Archies. guy, huh? Well, I love cartoons. It has, uh, it has Mr. Magoo. It has a lot oh, of yeah, the classic. Oh, yeah, Mr. Magoo. I, I watched that as a kid. Yeah, and yeah. it has these kids' program, and I recognize Jonathan Harris from Lost in Space was in a space co uh, deal yeah. for kids yeah. and everything. Yeah. It, I like that. I still, yeah. I'm still so a little not, kid in heart. It's not only me TV now. It's uh, a whole... Uh, Everything. Just, yeah, we, just we a, a long list of channels. All over the world. We got, uh, you got yeah. some uh, Euro European channels. Everything. Yeah. They're all they're all very well done, put together. Yeah, some specialized well. channels like yeah. uh, sports and yeah. whatever. Hey, a yeah. call coming in. Uh, call number three for Ronnie Paul. Good morning, caller. What's your question? Hey, What's caller. That? Hello. Caller, turn down the sound on your TV set, and you can ask your question. Otherwise, we got to go quickly. Huh? Hello. You can't hear hi. us. Hi. Oh, hi. How are you? I'm fine, Ronnie. This is Irene. Oh, Irene, hey, Irene, Irene. Irene, see, Irene, you remember Irene, Irene she called. Irene is yeah. calling in, yeah. How are you? I am fine, thank you. And how are you gentlemen this morning? Doing great, Good. Irene. Great, Good. great. Good. What's your question, Irene? We don't have much time. Ronnie? Yes. What's your question? You show fantastic oldies by goodies, and oldies by goodies like me really enjoy this and takes us way back and makes us feel really, really young. Oh, good. <laughs> Please don't stop showing them, okay? All right, good. See, I'm uh, tell her. I see, Irene. I mix it up. You don't know what I'm gonna do, right? Uh, yeah, <laughs> even the classic Jack Benny, whatever, down to the Jetsons, Flintstones, Donald the Duck, everything. I know Roadrunner. How about Roadrunner? All the Warner Brothers stuff. <laughs> <laughs> All the, yeah. <laughs> Even though I keep uh, suggesting Speedy Gonzales, I know you can't do that. But no, there's a few of them. Here. Speedy Gonzales, you yeah. do that? Yeah. yeah. Uh huh. And and everybody out there in TV land, keep on watching, connect with me and with the Ronnie Paul show. Thank you. Thank you, Irene. All right. What a sweet lady. She and is. A very faithful viewer. Oh yeah. Of long yours. time. Long and maybe time. ours too. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Hey, listen, I said you're a big sports fan. I want to talk about this a little bit. Let's put up the picture of Tony Gwynn, uh, former Major League Baseball player, 20 years with the San Diego Padres. Sadly, sadly, this morning he passed away of cancer uh, as a result of chewing tobacco. 54 years old, Ronnie. I mean... You're a Southern California type yeah, of guy. Uh -huh. I mean, he, you got, you got to, he's a Hall of Famer. No, he is. The guy was great. And unfortunately, you know, these baseball players, they love that chewing tobacco. And that's yeah. bad on your mouth. Uh, we had a friend that passed away from, from that, too. Yeah, he was inducted into the Baseball Hall of Fame in 2007. Sadly, he passed away this morning. Uh, 20 years, as I said, he played with the San Diego Padres. And just a couple of weeks ago, Bob Welch. Yeah, ex-A's and Dodgers, too. Ex-A's and Dodgers. Dodgers he too. died of a heart attack, 57 years old. Of course, uh, he, he battled alcohol all his life. Um, uh, he, uh, in 1990, um, was a two-time All-Star, of course, but in 1990, he won the Cy Young. He won 27 games with the A's. Who in this day and age wins 27 games? Not too many like that. Well, no. none. 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 It's a rarity. Yeah. yeah. So two young ball players. They're big loss in the Major League Baseball. They are like that, too. And, you know, football, we have the same thing, you know. You know, th these good players. Uh, Chuck Noll, you know, from the Steelers coach, he just passed away, too. He just died. Yeah. 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 Young, too young. Yeah, too young. He was, what, 82? 82, 82 years old. And what yeah. a, uh, you didn't, I didn't know anything was wrong. 
with him too. Now we now uh, the former Buffalo Bill uh, quarterback Jim Kelly. Yeah, Kelly. He's, he's battling, he's battling cancer. cancer. Mm. You know, and yeah. he's the poor guy. You know, I, you hate to see these things happen. Okay, quickly. We only got a few minutes left. Now, uh, your Dodgers are in second, uh, third place, I believe. In the second place. Second place. We're They're six and a half out. Uh, out. Uh huh. Okay, Colorado's still in there. Yeah, but Colorado could sneak. You don't know. They could sneak past your Dodgers. Uh, yeah. Uh -huh. Giants are still in first place. They had a bad week. They won. Oh, one they were won. swept by. They lost Colorado. six games and only won one in the past <laughs> yeah. week. Swept by Colorado. What do you What do you make of what's going on? That there? That's normal with all baseball teams. You know, yeah. there's nothing to lose sleep. No, because down. football you would worry. Baseball, you know, you can yeah. do this. It could yeah. happen because it's the A's, way it goes. The A's took two out of three from the Yankees. The A's, A's would be Derek you know, Jeter. like we talked about. They do well in 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 the in the regular season, but come postseason, either Detroit Tigers. Always spoil them, or or, or Boston, well, or Oakland whoever. doesn't have the horses to get past the playoffs. Yeah, but they're good. That yeah. that manager is a good manager. Uh, He's Bob Melvin's a good, yeah. very yeah. good. They're manager. both good. The Giants manager. Yeah, and they're both the, good. Yeah, they're, they're both Bochy good. And, and yeah, Melvin are very San good. San Francisco has yeah. Bay Area teams. Football, yeah. uh, they're great. Everything yeah. is good. So, Ronnie, let's get back to your show. Uh, I know you're a big sports fan. Do you ever talk about sports on your show? Oh, all the time. When football yeah. baseball season, I had a couple of friends that were. Giant fr uh, fans over here, and I did uh, the Giants, and I did the Dodgers too. You ever get so any players on your? You any, any anybody from Fresno State? Uh, f say I am working or? on uh, De uh, Derek to come. He promised me, even when he became a uh, Oakland Raider. So uh, we're working on him during the. You got his cell break. phone? You no, got his cell no, phone? that I don't have. Okay. <laughs> right. No, Give but I have former Rams, former ex players that come. Uh, Once come in a while, visit. they, yeah, they, they come, come through. Uh -huh. huh? They come through. We have our Ram group, and they come visit, and yeah. they come up. So, you know what you should do is if, I don't know if it's legal, but, you know, show a clip of an old football game back in the 50s no, and we 60s. Do that. I do that. Have you done that? Yeah, I've done Have that. Have you done that? Uh-huh. Okay. Well, how do we, yeah, I got, I brought it to you. Remember? Remember? Oh, that? that's right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, game. What game was that? That I was forgot. a 51 uh, championship. The 51 team. championship. Yeah. But you don't do that as often as you run the cartoons or no, I Love no, Lucy no. or. Well, when we're, like, for example, World Series come along, I'll do former World Series clips. Of like the A's? A's, yeah. Dodgers. Dodgers. And then yeah. when the and then when opening season comes on, I do that football preseason time. Get ready for that. Yeah. Hockey. I'm gonna work on hockey after the Kings won. So I do sports. Right. Do you consider yourself a TV personality here in Fresno. Well, Seriously. I don't want to consider, but I, I let's put it this way: I, it's been fortunate to be doing this this long. What you like to do, you know, I don't consider myself a star or whatever. I just if but a I, local personality. Let's put it that. Well, way. after a few more years, and then maybe, maybe. But I'm just enjoying making the viewers happy, and with being on with you, that's a great treat. You know, being on being on radio, also former people, K. Jewel sometimes, and everything too. That's fun. You know, yeah. you know, you know, it's 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 more of enjoyment than, you know, I, I don't put myself else, in that know. category. Yeah. Well, but you've been on for 10 well, years. That's really, it's coming been, up on what's I've your 10 year lucky. anniversary. When's the anniversary? Uh, December. Years? December. This year? Yeah. So you. So well, that wow. radio, too, has been another 20 years interning and everything, too. So we're pushing 30 yeah, but years. On the air on your show, 10, ten years, years in December. That's pretty amazing. That's pretty good. That's been. That's been thanks to the viewers, and you yeah. know they can turn you off right away. You Faithful know, but you viewers be, like Irene. Yeah, you got to be humble. You know, you yeah. know, be courteous like you do. See, you have we're to humble here. I mean, yeah. we, this is our third year, and we're fortunate. We have the viewers, and uh, they like us. We have call-ins, yeah. so. Yeah. See, the viewers is the one who, who makes you. You know, you can sing and they dance. They can make and you and break you, yeah. right? Yeah. All right. Like as Pat, Pat Sajak, all he's got all his life. They gave him a variety right. show, didn't work. All he's stuck with Wheel of Fortune. That's it. Yeah. Ronnie, sadly, you're out of time. All right, come back here. Thank you're you welcome anytime. anytime. You're a friend of this show, and I'll Thank be on your show too. You let me know. You're welcome anytime. I will. Thank you. Thank I'll bring you. my son. <laughs> all right, and my daughter. Yeah, bring them both. Flying home with Ronnie Paul. Thank you for watching here on this edition of Connect with Me. We're back tomorrow with a focus on business. See you then. Have a great day.